What's up, Magic fans? Gonna show you a uh, another card fan, one hand card fan. Now, I should, before I showed you this one, okay? Which, okay, good. I'm gonna show you a much better one called doing this, okay? There you go. Here's how to do it. Now, keep in mind, I don't want people to say, well, I got old cards, and I can't. These cards are old as shit, okay? Now, if you have brand new ones, like if I had brand new ones right now, oh, it would look so pretty. But, uh, but these are about as, about as old as they get, and it still can be done. Look at that. Okay. Nothing, I mean, it's not the prettiest fan that I can make. But you can still do a fan. It doesn't have to be perfect. Okay? Now, here's how to do it. What you're going to do is this finger is going to go down at an angle. The pointer finger is going to go down at a diagonal, and it's going to be straight. The middle finger is going to be below it and curved, like, you know, bent. Okay? So at an angle, straight, and then bent. Your thumb is going to be all the way over here, in the other corner, okay? And it's going to be in the cross of your thumb. It's about as far in the cross of your thumb as it can go. Okay? Now you can use one finger, two finger, whatever. You're going to, from here, fan the cards around, just like that. Okay, and you can see how nice of a fan that is. It actually creates two, um, I don't know what you would call it, like two fans in one, in a way. Um, I love it. I love the way it looks. And then these cards are old as shit, so I want you to keep remember that. They're old. Very old. <laughs> um, Alright. Alright. Now, people say that uh, your middle finger will end up going straight, and your pointer finger will curve. It'll, like, switch. I've never done it. As you can see, I, it's still been this way. So, I mean, if you want to do that... Uh, do it if it helps you, but I've, I've never had to do that, okay? Now, if you do have it that way, if you do have it to where it's switched, that's cool because then you can just switch it again, and you have to, you, you pretty much half closed it, okay? Pretty much half closed the fan back up, okay? So it's like this, all right? See, just now with one motion of putting the pointer finger back, you pretty much pretty much have the fan closed. Now you can just use your other fingers to close it all the way again. Okay? So you do that. And again, close again. Try to get this way. Like that. And close them up. Okay? So, uh, just practice. Or if you want to do the fancier close, you can just use your finger. Close it up. I don't know. Whatever you want to do. But anyway, that's how you do it. Now, I cannot stress this enough. Practice. It doesn't and it doesn't mean you're doing anything wrong. If you can't get it and yours looks like I'm gonna try to do a screwy screwy one. I can't even do a screwy one now. <laughs> um I can't even do a screwy one. <laughs> it's just so natural now. Um if your cards look really, really like I have to like forcefully make a bad one. Like, your cards look like that. <laughs> I don't know. Um, just just keep keep trying, keep trying because let me tell you, it take. I mean, I I did the same way again and again and again and again. It was just frustrating me. They looked horrible. It took about a week, and then about after a week, I did it and boom, out of nowhere, it happened. And I was like. I do the same thing I've always been doing. All of a sudden it works. It's as crazy as that. It really is. So just keep doing it and doing it and doing it. And one day you will surprise yourself and you'll create a nice fan. And it'll just get nicer, nicer, nicer. So trust me on this. Again, pointer face diagonal straight. Uh, middle finger bent. Thumb all the way over in the corner. Boom. Okay. So, uh, Keep trying, and uh, that's a much better one-handed fan. I'm sure you're like. 
I'm out.